What about oh, porn? Dude, yeah, for <laughs> sure. Dude. Yo, I'm serious. Actually, back outside playing in parks and stuff. I, I'm not. Oh, ki oh I'm God, not porn. kidding. But that's yeah. that's beyond. That's like, you know, you. Yeah, I mean, that's uh, that's where you get you get like. I, I'm get, an like, investor. Twisted because you get to be sitting next to somebody on the bus. And they're just like. Uh, uh. <laughs> 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 what the fuck? Was big. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh my God. We should ask the AI to to write. Um, to read to do the remake for Terminator 2. Yeah, holy cow, dude. It's oh like, my god. Yeah, but we had a different outcome. This is how we see it happen, you know? It's like, oh my <laughs> god. Yeah, it's like we win. Yeah. Hey, what's up, D boss? Yo, what's, what's up? up? Hey, chatter? first time chatter, buddy. Thank you for joining in, my friend. What's going uh, on, guys? Let's say basically they're actually making VR more um, to to make that ceiling a little bit higher, and I think it's more uh, the ceiling for immersion because now I'm seeing peripherals like gloves and hey, not much, boss. Right. But 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 like they're creating now like gloves that you can actually like feel an object like like this water bottle, and you put on the glove, and you can actually feel this virtual reality water bottle within the glove, and you're like, holy shit. So like they're creating like a more of a realistic world, almost creating Ready Player One. You know what I mean? Like they're in it. We're right, getting but, close. But you're still limited to that world. Right. You can't go into any other worlds. And I see what you're saying because you've got augmented. You've got the real world and the augmented world within one. Yeah. Like if you're okay, let's just say for example, I get whatever that. you're wearing augmented reality, right? And they say, you know, you have. Uh, like you program it in, mm -hmm. like I ate, like they'll ask you, when did you last eat? Oh, I ate at 9 a.m. Okay, cool. It's 9.30. All right, cool. And they give you like your hunger meter. Mm -hmm. And as you're playing, your hunger meter sits there and goes down and it says, oh, you need to eat. And the game can recognize or the AR technology can recognize, hey, I'm eating something. And then your bar fills up. With VR, it's just kind of like you're at the mercy of what the virtual reality is telling you to do. How long till we achieve an entry level into another reality? Over what you're doing. Which I like. Yeah. Without... I mean, that makes sense because then you have like your, it's kind of going off of like your body and that sort of thing. I, I understand what you're saying with augmented reality where you have those two different worlds. I'm just saying like, I feel like VR is growing quite well too. So. Yeah, the uh, the boss says, "How long till we achieve an entry level into another reality without excess gear?" It's gonna be a while. Yeah, I would say that's like that's Matrix level right there, you know. Yeah, and that's that's kind of like what we were we we were chat what we were talking about before you entered in was, uh, I just personally felt, in my opinion, that VR is going to reach a cap because we're only limited. You're going to be limited by what you can do in VR. Based off of the accessories, mm -hmm. based off of the environment. With and AR yeah. technology, you're able to be in two environments at once. You're able to, um, you know, you're able to to interact with reality. Uh, he says VR is with headgear? Question mark. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's it's you're I you're mean, inside well, of a world. You have the headgear on. You're in. You're in that specific world that okay. you're in, basically. What yeah. about yeah. that kind of thing? But, but yeah, I'm, you know, like when you when you start getting into like without gear, um, you know, Ready Player One or Sao Sword Art Online. Yeah, you start getting into that type of stuff. Yeah, it's fully virtual, and it's that, gonna be a while. That's what I'm talking about. Submerged in in that type of environment. What what about? What about a kind of a what thing about, without, gear? without gear? Oh, well, it, they would have to look at biocompatibility. Like implants. Uh, yeah, yeah, implants. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I know. I know. Elon was kind of talking about it. Um, he had dabbled with it. Yeah. No. And so we we did talk about that in the beginning of our conversation too about like you know. Going we'd like Neuralink. How far do you think that Neuralink? Yep. Yes. Exactly. Neuralink, yep. Yeah, like how far are we out from that type of technology too? And uh, obviously Elon Musk is talking about it, so we're kind of on the outskirts of it happening maybe? I don't know. Well, I it's, mean, it's all in theory right now. Yeah. Um, I don't think there, there's actually like... An actual physical thing play, in it. Play it out for me. Yeah. 
let's say there's some kind of um, it happens oh you want you want us to play it out like how it works or let's yeah. say it happens okay let's say it happens yeah all right so like we're 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 gonna we're getting our computer is this like the only computer that's uh out there right now that we have to implant and this is what the new technology is we're getting rid of Effect, PCs effects on reality it, right? yeah sure i mean shoot yeah. when are, i'm gonna pre-order mine for sure and i'm gonna i'm gonna get right in there uh, i'm gonna install twitch for sure we gotta have twitch on our on my Neuralink because i'm gonna be streaming yeah late, and, late and essentially streams. what you could do is it <laughs> how big be, instead of watching you think twitch it will be with you know the green screen of the the, the camera of the person and the game you actually yeah. are just first person looking at what this person is doing in yeah in uh that virtual or in that alternate reality i think i would have a lot uh, more in real life streams if we did that because i could pretty much just stream all the time in real life and just be like hey this is what i'm doing i'm at the grocery store real in yeah. irl grocery store stream Interesting. Yeah. Shit, you know <laughs> so you would have more of that become... more accessibility well, that's, that's if it's that's if it's like oh uh, you know using your eyes as lenses but uh, yeah exactly more accessibility but yeah Okay, Absolutely. but I think you could. I think I I think it would be really cool because it would take warping to a whole nother level. What about oh, porn? Dude, yeah, you for know, sure. Dude. Action role play. You Yo, have I'm serious. Out, actually, back outside playing in parks and stuff. I, I'm not. Oh, ki oh I'm God, not porn. kidding. That's yeah. that's beyond. That's like, you know, you. Yeah, I mean, that's uh, that's where you get you get like. I I'm get, an like, investor. Twisted because you could be sitting next to somebody on the bus and they're just like. Uh, <laughs> was big you know? oh, oh my god yeah porn would be you know? that that specific area would just huge money You're yeah yeah, right, yeah. Boss. yeah that's like a gold mine waiting to happen for that because it's like you it, it one it's kind of sad because you're not gonna have that human your, interaction anymore. every we're gonna lose, we're gonna lose human interaction explore your every fantasy no, like, no none of that but you can explore your every fantasy, which is your right. You could do everything you wanted to. It's what kind it's of gonna be price pretty wild. Could yeah. you? Yeah, and then you know you're. you're uh, I think it would be cool for the dating scene because you could go on a virtual date with somebody, and you know. Um, what kind of price? The could price you could be on a virtual. You could be a virtual date with somebody before actually like meeting or you know meeting yeah. them. Yeah, yeah, you could actually get all that visual attraction everything over with before even meeting which is cool and what you're right price would i put on that uh, i would that yeah. kind of thing i would put what? a one-time price tag it would be like when it comes to uh, money like a utility i would make it like insurance, oh yeah like you i know, have the electricity very bill, little or, more you know absolutely you would just be paying on it as long as you want to be in it you're paying for it monthly payment every month yeah monthly payment so like a sub you know yeah yeah, so yeah, it would be like a subscription. I, yeah, I, I yeah. completely agree. But like so a sub, yeah, yeah, yeah. Subscription you would just based, be for sure. to it. Yeah. yeah, for sure. <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah, right. Pretty interesting stuff, though. I mean, it's yeah. it's a kind of it, it all depends on how Neuralink gets implanted and how all that stuff goes by, what kind of security it has. I mean, it, to play it out that way, and and you know. There are real just, issues. Just think about it. It's kind of like, uh, I would have to. They would have to have all that in check. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, agreed. Yeah, it's there it's, are yeah, real there issues. Are definitely real issues. For sure. Real issues. Of yeah. all of that technology, though, looking at all of like the futuristic movies and stuff, the only the one thing that I think is plausible. I mean, yes, Ready Player One is plausible. Yeah. And it depends on how much of an investment goes into this virtual world right now meta is the only one that's big kind of like money, money. Traveling into it yes i have seen westworld mm -hmm. that, 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 um, but the other one is is right. called um out of time and I, that's the one with justin timberlake where uh, um you know uh, he has the time on yeah, the yeah, yeah 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 it's implanted in you Yep. Yeah, I could see us going that way with currency. Yeah, Where, yeah, you like, could, we don't have but a currency anymore. We don't have a card. Like, yeah, we have Apple Pay. You know, we have all this other stuff. But you are the bank. 
of your money. Yeah. So when you get paid, you look down at your arm and it's like, you got paid. And it's all... Yeah, yeah, that's not going to happen. Yeah. That type of thing. And when you go to buy something, we don't need checkouts anymore. We just grab it and as we leave, it's as the ducks. As long as... Same. The yeah. we would still have Amazon order yeah is as long as I the order can kind of be plausible mm -hmm. but, is uh, yeah West getting World the data is, is a great show yeah. if you haven't yeah. seen it highly recommend it that I'm could happen it. that also taps into ai you know yeah then yeah that could happen um, ai is, is is becoming advanced we're almost to like that skynet stage you know we're getting there yeah it's with, getting a little uh, scary yeah yeah, it's getting very. You know, scary. the AI generated images and the AI. Yeah. Actually, they're having it now where AI can write. Yeah, and I've seen AI that. AI can write mm -hmm. movie scripts, and it's just like. Holy ugh. shit! Yeah. Deep fakes and really shit. Smart. Chat GPT. We should, we should Deep ask fakes. AI to to, yeah. re, to rewrite. Uh, yeah, the Chat GPT. We should ask AI to. To write. Um, to re to do the remake for Terminator Two. Yeah, holy cow, dude. Oh it's my like, god. Yeah, but we had a different outcome. This is how we see it happening, you know? It's like, oh my god. <laughs> yeah, like, we win. Yeah. Holy okay, god. entertain me. That would be insane. En entertain entertain I'd me. I'd be scared, dude. I'd be like, Tell this is the scariest movie ever. Your favorite yeah, or we go to part ask them about to, to like, this. Uh, yeah, we asked them to, to rewrite The Matrix. They were like, what are you talking about? That's, that's, yeah, <laughs> that's not fiction. That's, that's real. You know, and everybody's like, you know. <laughs> Tell me your favorite favorite part. part about this happening. Uh, well, I mean, I, about AI taking over the world. No, 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 no. I'm a Terminator fan, so it'd no, be kind of cool no. before I get my head ripped off. <laughs> no. oh, okay, no, I, I, I mean, I mean, what part, what part we are <laughs> like a the chat, the AI? Full the, immersion. The, VR. Like, I, I like it because oh. it's an escape from reality. Absolutely. I, mean, I, I, like, I like just, you know, that, that's like the stress. Yeah, the full immersion. Um, that's why, you know. So it's like you're there, you experience like everything. I have a, the motion thing with VR. Mm. So I mean, I'm contemplating investing into a treadmill, a VR treadmill, so that I can have that full immersion and it's like when i'm walking i'm walking in the game so yeah. i don't get that disconnect and my motion isn't all thrown off but uh the yeah, only way VR i'm investing in this i really do i i didn't like our original my original mm -hmm. opinion like i didn't mean to knock it i was just saying i think that it's going to reach a cap a ceiling uh, where it's like okay max everything you can do in virtual reality we can where do a pair um, of unless it's like uh normal i don't know if you've seen the show glasses and go on amazon prime it's about I basically the one. afterlife mm -hmm. and when you die your brain is uploaded into a virtual reality and it, it's kind of a trippy show but like when you look at the plot itself it can get really scary really freaky but um yeah i think that's that's pretty much the only way like as long as you're wearing headgear and treadmill the only way i'm investing in this headgear and treadmills yeah, yeah. is yeah i mean if it was like the model of just regular pair of glasses and you can just put them on and go headgear and treadmills is yeah. inefficient for me for vr um, i'm a huge vr advocate full. i think um out of the th out of the three of us that when we stream plus. on here or whatever how much a full I, setup i've mainly been talking about vr ever since i've got my quest 2 and it's been a game changer for me in gaming like i when i go and back to play my series x or my pc games and stuff like that it's like night and day i want to go back yeah to it's my so VR much better headset and jump into that world and play yeah. ghosts of tabor or jump in it and like right now that's all i can think about is ghosts of tabor because i've been playing that i was in that world and i love it everything the guns and everything it's just, it's fucking amazing how interactive these VR games are getting and how realistic yeah. it's starting to look. It's, it's getting mind blowing. And I, it's to me, it's getting better than the flat games that I'm playing in my opinion, but that's just my own opinion. I'm a VR lover at heart. So I'm sure. talking, um, from how much the full setups cost nowadays, are you business. talking like full setup, like the vest and the treadmill and the headset, like depending on what platform headset you want to go with, the yeah, full, index or whatever. Full. But oh, complete from a business standpoint. Oh, okay. Um, 
I I've looked into it. Uh, so the treadmills price has gone down. Um, I think they're they're right out the two thousand dollar range right now, and that's not like the the biggest one. Uh, they're about two two thousand twenty five hundred just for the treadmill. You're talking um, a lot of those treadmills. I'm not sure. They say that they have input, like they talk to the Quest Two. Um, uh, a lot of the wired setups, though, you would you're talking about another couple thousand dollars. So you're talking, I would say, for one setup, probably about five fifty five hundred to six thousand dollars for I was, everything. I was gonna say eight. And that's, yeah, that's like that's Pretty like close. a, a like four K. Like you're talking top of the line visor, top of the line PC running the visor. Motherfucker. Uh, treadmill. Yeah, you're talking. Yeah. So, it's it's expensive. Uh, there is there is another technology that's out there. It's kind of they're calling it like bad investment, bro. It's uh, the spatial VR, and I've I've looked into it personally, and I think that's a better investment or a better thing. Yeah, it's where uh, the the cameras map you in the room, like you have sensors on your visor, on your backpack, and they give you like a gun and stuff. Yeah, and they put you in the game, and you're but you're walking around in a big room. You don't have like a treadmill, so you eliminate that cost. But then now you're just investing into the property, and having cameras set up. Um, but the, yeah, there are a few companies out there that are willing to. to Holy to fuck! Stuff. But it's it, it's fun. I've experienced it firsthand. Project um, has it. I, I, have, I haven't gone to that. Yeah, I haven't done that. I yet. can imagine. It is fucking amazing. So yeah, I. I can't that wait. Is I, a game changer. I can't wait. Yeah, I holy fuck! I think that, uh, then, that's so like, complicated. To, you know, but I can't imagine. And not I can imagine it's awesome to VR. play with. So getting that full immersion effect to it, and actually walking yeah. not in a treadmill and doing that, it'd be like, wow, this is pretty wild. So. Yeah, I know that. I know there's a couple of locations worldwide, and I think the one that that I want to say it's in Moscow or in Russia, but I don't know. Wow. You know, the whole Russia thing. Yeah, yeah. But um, they have it to where it's like when when there's a wall, like there's a real wall in real life, or there's a box, there's a real box. So in virtual reality, like if you're gonna squat down behind the box, you're literally leaning up and squatting down behind the box. So um, a lot of the other places don't have that, so you kind of like have clipping issues, and you're just kind of like, oh my god, you know. So, oh wow, that'd be yeah. Weird. There are there are. Yeah, there are places that are mapping what's in the game into reality and like physically putting a box where it should be or a wall where Ooh. it should be or they have like That's elemental smart. things where if there's wind you'll have a fan or if there's heat you'll have like a hot like heater, a heater blowing hit you. at you. Yeah. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The only way this is going Man. mainstream that this this has definitely spiraled into a solid rando segment here, dude. Like we we've, we've, this is, we've, we've talked about this is all going, this new technology and it's it's getting exciting you know what i mean the exciting times are right around the corner Maybe this is going i'm shame. excited for you know this virtual reality stuff um it's just getting if, better and better and better it, and games are replicating itself of yeah. those triple a games that are out there now which is pretty exciting so you know uh, good times are ahead of us boys for sure accessible definitely yeah i want to thank the boss many uh, for people Coming in and chat with us. Yeah, thank you. The, awesome. uh, yeah, heck yeah, that's awesome. Oh, good. The only way this is the going boss. to main going mainstream Welcome is if it can be as accessible to as many people. Random shit this uh, week, Joe. Accessible to as many people. No. Okay. No, I think uh, as many yeah, people think... covered up quite yeah, a bit today. Out. <laughs> Sounds good, man. Sounds good. Well, I appreciate each and every one of you guys being here today, and uh, we'll yeah, see you on the next one. Um, it's the only way is going mainstream. It can be accessible to as many people at PCs and phones. Yeah, no problem, the boss for sure. We're gonna take yeah. it easy, and we'll see you on the next one, the boss. All right, All right take care. Take and care. Uh, yep. this take is care. Deuce. Thanks for the follow, boss. Thank no you. Good, I appreciate no you, good, buddy. No yep. Hell yeah! Thank you for the follow. No good, bro. All right. This